Hey guys, Bashar One here and today I'll be doing a review of Automatico M1918 which is in my opinion the best assault weapon not only for close combat but it's also effective at medium distance. I played a lot with this weapon as a assault class and I've been totally surprised at how good I've been doing. First when I started playing Battlefield 1 I've been using random weapons because I was curious which one will fit my game style and I must admit that I had a lot of trouble searching for perfect weapon. Generally, I'm always a fan of weapons with higher fire rate, so I guess this one is probably related to that thing. Also, I've been watching a lot about this Automatica weapon and I've discovered that even others are using this weapon pretty often. So today I've decided to show you my gameplay with that weapon where you will be able to see few parts of it. To be honest, I did better with this weapon than some guys been doing with solo tank. And if you ever played Battlefield 1, you could notice how it's easy to play and control that tank. Also, if you wanna see my review about it, make sure to click on that picture that you are able to see on your screen and check out my video about solo tank. Anyway, Automatico 1918 was a submachine gun introduced late in World War 1. The weapon features an unconventional overhead inserted magazine designed to assist loading and chambering of rounds using gravity. The weapon was the first submachine gun to be used by the Italian armed forces during the conflict and it's possibly the first of this type to be used as a general issue combat weapon. You have three variants of this weapon in Battlefield 1 and they are available for a soul class. I'll leave a stats of all three weapons on the screen so you guys can check it out. It's much better to see than to listen to me talking about it. Automatico M1918 factory variant has no attachments except for bayonet. The trench variant is equipped with a foregrip and bayonet and has greatly increased hipfire accuracy compared to standard version. The light infantry variant is also equipped with a foregrip and bayonet and has marginally increased accuracy and control over the factory variant. By my opinion and what I've seen so far, I believe this weapon will be the best weapon ever after full version of Battlefield 1 is released and it's going to be uh, today, so that's why I decided to release this video and share it with you guys exactly today. If you are a new player like I am because I never liked Battlefield before, you know, and I started to play Battlefield 4 before just a couple of months, then I believe you will try this weapon and love it same as I do. If you like to rush and get in close combat situations, then you will be pretty amazed how good this weapon is. Uh, very effective in close combat and by aiming down the sight you can do more than 3 kills in single magazine. But as I said at the start of this video, you will first have to learn how to control its fire rate because in a lot of situations you will find yourself spraying and not killing anyone or you will stay without ammo where you will need good teammate to resupply you. Anyway, I will recommend you to try all three variants of this weapon and if you like to hip fire a lot then definitely you should try it trench version of this weapon, you will be amazed with hip fire effectiveness and actually how good this weapon is. In my opinion it's much easier to kill players in close combat while hip firing because a lot of us do it almost all the time and to be honest iron sights are somehow hard to use so aiming through ADS is less effective than hip firing 
just please pay attention of clip size because it has 25 bullets as you could hear on weapon stats and hear me previously talking about it so you wanna make sure that you are putting these bullets directly on target and not missing around also please have in mind that you wanna use this weapon on short reloading because it's gonna take you only 1.8 seconds it means you wanna make sure to reload your magazine before it's fully empty in case that you spray it all the way down it will take around 3 seconds to reload it which is taking a lot of your time and of course I'm saying all this because I'm giving you advices how to be a true combat hero and go directly into combat so all these seconds matters a lot and you don't wanna find yourself in the middle of combat wasting 3 seconds on reloading so please have it on mind guys The enemy has defused objective butter And now you are probably expecting me to say negative things about this weapon but simply I don't have anything to add on it. Uh, I would like to mention it once again that you should use this weapon if you are going in close combat and not to fight in distance. This is one of the best so far for close combat battles and have in mind that in full version you will be able to have a customization option for this so I believe it's gonna be much better anyway you will also notice a little higher vertical and horizontal recoil which is easy to get to use at least I haven't had a problems and as I said I'm totally new in this game so I believe those guys who are playing longer will be a true heroes with this weapon I cannot wait to see a full release of this game and to see what stats it will have also I would like to hear your opinion guys about this weapon do you like this one or you have another one which is your favorite please let me know down in comments and generally are you excited to try Battlefield 1 today give me a few seconds please to make a shout out to my big friend Black Swan Gaming who is also doing great videos and montages to be honest he's playing a lot of more different games and i believe you will find something for yourself and to enjoy you can visit his profile by simply clicking on that picture on my screen and it will redirect you on his youtube account also you may find link of his profile in my video description Anyway, that was pretty much of it for today guys, uh, I hope you really had fun watching and if you wanted to see review about this weapon that you were on the right place, I'll be happy if this video was of help for you. Take care and see you in one of my next videos, enjoy! Watch it!